Hallelujah to Jesus. Today is the day that the Lord has made. Therefore, you will rejoice and be glad in it. I commit to you and I commit to your entire household under the authority of the blood of Jesus this blessed day. I pray that may the Spirit of the living God be a shelter and a provision, a cover around you. May the Lord protect your going out and may the Lord protect your coming in this very day. This day I pray that may the hand of the Lord be strong upon you and may the favor of God speak for you. I pray for you according to the word of God in Zechariah chapter 4 and verse 7. Who art thou, O great mountain, before Zerubbabel that shall become like a plain, and shall bring forth the headstone thereof with shouting, crying, grace, grace unto it. I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus that any mountain that will rise up against you any mountain of obstacles, any mountains of infirmity, any mountains of failure, any mountains of blockade, any mountains of accidents, any mountains of delay, any mountains of shame and failure. I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ that they shall not stand against you as they were not able to stand against the Rubabel. So shall the hand of the Lord prevail against your enemies in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I pray that today you will bring forth your headstone. I pray that today your favor shall rise like the sun. I pray that today your glory shall be lifted up like the noonday. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost, anything that have limited you, anything that have resisted you for years and for decades, any powers that have fought against your family, your father's house and your mother's house, I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus for your vindication, for your release and for your relief this very day. May the Spirit of the living God and may the Word of the Lord Lord speak for you this very day. I pray by the mandate of the blood of the Lamb that may the hand of the Lord be strong upon you today. Let Romans chapter 16 and verse 20 speak for you in every area of your life. And the God of peace shall bruise Satan under your feet shortly. And the grace of God of our Lord Jesus Christ will be with you this very day. May the Lord bruise the head of any serpentine power that will rise up against you. Anyone that have gathered against your destiny that do not want you to achieve your glory in life. Any serpentine spirit that have risen up against your marital joy. Today I pray in the name of the Lord Jesus by the covenant of the blood of Jesus that today may Romans chapter 16 and verse 20 to speak on your behalf. May you bruise every work of the enemy. May you break every monument. May you break every ordinance. May you destroy every foundation that have been laid against your destiny, against your progress, against your ministry, against your joy, against your life, against your childbirth, against your growth, against the work of your hands. Anything that have been lifted up against you today, may the word of the living God God rebuke them. May the word of the living God destroy every enemy before you. I pray that let the path of life be released unto you. May the path of pleasantness be your portion this day. May the joy of the Lord be your strength. May everything that you have lost, may you recover. May you recoup. May you be elevated. May you be exalted from this very day. Wherever you were denied, wherever you were rejected, wherever your children and your destiny was denied and rejected today by the power of the blood of the Lamb. May you be acceptable. May you be honored. May you be lifted in the name of the Father, Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Today is the day that will here mark you for greatness. It is your day of achievement. It is your day of fulfillment. It is your day of divine testimony. Today go out in the strength of the Lord, for you shall be celebrated for the glory of the Lord shall be upon you and no infirmity, no disease, no sickness shall come before your dwelling because the hand of the Lord shall preserve you this day. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost we have prayed. In Jesus' name we call it done. Amen. This is Apostle Dr. Jerry Otain from Global Harvest Ministries Worldwide. Remember, you are a property of the Holy Ghost. Satan, back off. In Jesus' name. Amen.